Hey, Norm. Hi, West. Hey, I'm Wes Davies here in Pagosa Springs, here with Pagosa.com's Norm Vance. Norm, what are you doing up here at the Sports and Supply Store? Well, I'm doing Hunter Hospitality. Uh, yeah. Have been doing so for 26 years. Come up, uh, we do a lot of things for them. I'm out here on the motorcycle. I visit with uh, hunters in their camps every day <laughs> through the seasons. Uh, have a little Hunter's Yellow Pages that I hand out. It has uh, information on it about the hospitality events. The most important thing they're looking for on there is all the places you can buy a shower. Sure. And this happens to be one of them up here in the far northwest part of Pagosa country. Uh, but also we do a website called Pagosa.com. And uh, on that I put up a daily updated photographs of me going around getting pictures of successful hunters with their antlers. Uh, they always love that. We invite them to call home, tell their family and friends to uh, go to Pagosa.com, see the picture. <laughs> I also do uh, the Big Game Hunters radio show that airs uh, every night here locally in Pagosa country. The interviews that I do with the hunters during the day uh, is, are on that radio show uh, during the evening hour. Also, it's on kwuf.com. So, again, they can call home and tell their friends and family to go to the computer. If they've got speakers on it, they can go to kwolf.com, click on the show, and hear the entire show along with their hunters interview. And we do contests and prizes. I'm always looking for the best camp for each uh, season. I'm looking for the best camp cook for each season. Uh, as I drove around in the early years of doing this, the hunters were just always very uh, cordial, invite you to come in, have a lot of hospitality, and they always wanted to feed me. So I decided, why don't we just base a contest on that? And uh, we also do the Help Keep Our Forest Green and Clean promotion, strictly based on uh, hunters packing it in and packing it out. If they're caught doing a good job with their trash, bringing it back into a dumpster in town, uh, couple of dumpsters that we have available for them there. If they get spotted, they may win one of our prizes. And the common ordinary prize is the best uh, thing that they could want up here is a trip to the Great Pagosa Hot Springs. 23 hot tubs down there, showers. Uh, they absolutely love getting the prize for the best uh, of anything. They, they win those prizes. And I guess the fun contest that we do is every season I'm looking for the dirtiest hunter oh, no. in the San Juan. These guys get out and uh, get something. They spend a day or more uh, trying to get it back in. They're absolutely covered from top to bottom. It is a contest where we tell them they need to find a river, stream, pond, and at least kind of cut the first layer off before yeah. they go into town to, uh, to get their uh, great hot spinks great hot springs bath. So just all the things that we have going on for them here. We think it is the largest and most varied hunter hospitality event mm -hmm. in the USA. That's awesome, yeah. So Norm, tell us about what we're going to be doing today. Who are we going to be visiting after we leave this spot here? Well, we have kind of a special event that came up. Uh, a lady, uh, wife of a fellow that's in a hunting camp down the road here, uh, sent me a uh, email message, a letter. We corresponded back and forth several letters now and uh, she was telling me what a wonderful camp her family puts up and specifically about uh, Ron Miner that's been go coming up here for 30 years straight. Mm -hmm. A little down on his health this year. Uh, she wanted me to come up and get a good interview with uh, that entire camp. So we're going to go out and take a look at that we understand there's 16 people in camp, yeah. uh, the kids, the grandkids, and so forth, and I will bet that they've been successful already here on their big game hunt. So we'll probably be getting a radio interview and some photographs of them, along with uh, honoring Ron as uh, the sportsman and hunter of the decade here in Pagosa. Well, Country. that's going to be quite a surprise. Well, let's go check it out, Norm. We're going to do that.
on the mountain, he was beaten and stomped in the ground. He was singing the call of the wild boys when I fired that lone faithful round. And we are hunting the ghosts of country. We are hunting the bulls of the woods. We are hunting the great San Juan Range. Oh Lord, this the ghost of country's good. Now it's mighty lonely up in the mountains.